friends, welcome. Today I'm going to be talking about my best and worst luxury purchases. Uh, there, are some, there are some items in my collection that I cannot believe that I didn't have them sooner and I'm so glad they're in my collection and I don't know how I would ever live my life without them. I mean, technically I could, but you know, I'm better off with them. Um, and then I have some items that, um, you know, like I feel like I shouldn't have gotten, but I'm still, I'm still glad that they're in my collection, but you know, I'm glad I bought them so you don't have to. So why don't we get into it? Let's start off with, you know, a pot on a positive note. Let's do one of my best purchases, my Dior satchel bag. Now, the reason why I love this bag so much is because it goes with everything. It's like the perfect brown tone where it doesn't kind of like blend into other browns, but it's kind of like a yellowy tone when you match it, with, pair it with browns that it really goes with everything. I love it with white, I love it with blacks. Um, it's perfect for the summer, it's perfect for the winter and the autumn months. And honestly, it's a perfect year round bag. So I am so glad that I have this bag in my collection. I don't know where I'd be without it. So this makes my favorite, my top favorite bag. And with that note, let's go on to something I kind of regret. This is a, a Prada bandeau top. And as much as I love it, it's something that I opt for sometimes, but it's one of those pieces that makes it hard to breathe. So I really have to like, squeeze into it not something that i can wear when i'm super bloated but i love it but you know what this one has to go into the ones that i kind of regret buying and now back onto a positive um something that i bought something that i bought recently and something that i love so much and that goes with everything are these bottega shoes um i forgot what they're called but i will link it in the uh, in the box below but i love these shoes for weddings I love these shoes for special events. Honestly, it's that little pop of perfection that adds something unique to an outfit. I love that it's kind of mesh here and it's like a fabric-y mesh. And I love it because it cut, it makes, it's, it's different. It's an accent piece, it's unique and it adds something to an outfit and really goes with everything. And I love it so much. Um, they're white, so you never go wrong with a white pair of shoes. They go with colored outfits, like a color, pretty colored dress. Um, they go with black, they go with white, they can go with jeans. They're perfect with jeans and pretty dresses. I just love these so much and I'm so glad they're in my collection. They're a newbie, but they're going to be an oldie and they're gonna be, you know, in my collection forever. So I love these so, so much. Another negative. So this is something that I started um, getting at the beginning of my luxury journey. And so this is kind of, this is a YSL card holder. It's super cute, it goes with everything, but I mean, since I've gotten it, I haven't used it. So if I'm not using it, it's definitely not something that I love. Um, it's cute, it goes with everything, it's practical, but I think my biggest fault with it is the fact that it's a really stiff leather, and so just getting cards in and out makes it so difficult. And I mean, it's such a cute, it's such a cute dainty piece, and I think I'm, I'm never gonna let it go, but it's just, you know, it makes, um, I have memories with it, but, it's just, yeah, I don't reach for it. So it's gonna be a no. Um, and let's go to another positive. So I got these recently and I love them so much. They are the, the Celine Round Sunnies. These are these have been so trendy and popping on Instagram and all, all the blogger platforms. And I love these so much because they really go with everything. They I didn't think that the, these would uh, suit my face shape, but they really do. And I really, really love them. And like, at first I didn't really like this logo and I thought it was a bit too flashy, but now that I use it often, my style is so minimal that I really think that these are super, super cute and I love them so much and I'm really glad they're in my collection and I think that I'm gonna be wearing them forever and ever because they're such a classic, such a round, cute classic and yeah, these are one of my favorites for this year. And now on to another negative. Third negative has to be these Fendi shoes. Um, I love them and they go with my Fendi bag, but I think my issue with them is that they're not super comfortable. Although they're flats, they're a bit pointy. So these kind of cut like, kind of like, you know, pressure, there's pressure around here, around my feet. I love, I love the look of these. They're not super comfortable. And because they were a compulsive buy, I didn't really plan my outfits and pair it with outfits that I would wear. And so it's hard to style these. 
They're just not something that I reach for very often and if I'm not reaching for them, they're not a love. So these are definitely a part of my negatives. I have to put these ones in the negative as well. These are Dior sandals that I got a few years back and as much as I love them, they're also not comfortable. They're not comfortable, they hurt my feet, I get blisters when I wear them. I know, I think it's just gonna take time for me to um, break these in but I got these on sale and I feel like that always happens when there's a sale you just start you just want don't want to take that time for granted and so you always have to so I tend to try and make a decision and I thought these were a good decision at the time they're black they're sandals they seem to look comfortable but these are a negative because they're not really that comfortable a favorite of mine is something that I love so much and I love it and you can tell that this item has been loved is the Jacques Mousse dress. So it's kind of, there's a cutout in between here, but it doesn't actually show anything. So you, when you do wear it, it's kind of like up like this. And then you have, a, it looks like you're wearing a skirt and a crop top, which I love. It is just something, it's like one of those dresses that you throw on and you're good to go. I got this baby on sale. So I only spent around $200 for this. And I think it's one of the best purchases I've ever made. It's perfect for the winter time. I love just throwing on a, a classic blazer on top of this and it's so wearable with tights and boots. But I also love it for summers. And you know, it's just a, such a classic piece. I'm someone who, when I travel, I like to just have something that I throw on. It looks great, it's super cute. And this is a go, such a go-to for that. It is completely perfection and I love it so much. So this one is definitely in my Definitely don't regret buying this one and I love it. So this is a good purchase for me. Let's finish this off with um, a positive and something that I still really, really love. And that, and that is my Saint Laurent Reeve Gauche bag. I love, love this bag because it literally fits my life and everything beyond that. It is that perfect travel bag. It is that perfect summer bag. It's such a pretty summer color. And I know that this is a couple, um, a few seasons. So this was super popular last summer. And I know it's not like super trendy right now, but it's something that I think I'm gonna have forever. It's the perfect bag to throw in. It also wasn't too expensive either. It's just that it's like a good go-to bag not something super expensive. I love that this is can a coated canvas. And so if there's if I get mud or dirt on this, I can just easily wipe it off. The inside of this, I have stuffing in here, but they have there's buttons here where you can there's a closure so you could always opt to close your bag if that's something that you like. I actually personally don't mind and I'm just happy to have it like just open like this and just toss things in, but this is just the perfect perfect bag to put all your belongings in, put your life in it, and it is super perfect. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you liked my favorites, my not so favorites. You know, I'm spending the money, so then you guys don't have to, and I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please remember to subscribe to this channel, hit the bottom like button if you like this video, and subscribe to continue watching and see what's up. What's up next? Thanks. Bye now.